I'm Lynn Browner, and I have a son, Owen, who is 11 and helps me paint. He helps me paint the backgrounds with a hand-over-hand method, working on his fine motor skills. So, I told myself I wasn't going to paint flowers tonight, and I sat down, and I looked across to my paints, <laughs> and I saw this blue, and I said, flower. <laughs> so, here I am getting ready to paint flowers. <laughs> but in my mind, I'm, and I already did this a little, like, not the way I wanted it to go. But we'll see. Um, in my mind, I'm doing these kind of, um, more like, um, lavender type, I think that's the right, but they're not just, um, lavender, they're not lavender, but we'll see, I might have to add something in it. <laughs> do change my mind. I'm not sure. Sometimes when I think I'm going to do, most of the time, let's just say it, most of the time when I think I'm going to do one thing, it changed my mind. So we'll see if I follow, <laughs> follow through with everything I want to do. Um, so far, I'm sticking to it. So today was Owen's second day of school for this year. And, um, it was, his day at school, this is what's always hard. His day at school was good, but when he comes home and when we go to do different things, that's when the release of energy is. It's hard for him to go to school and have so many activities and so many things. I was on there. I think I got it. Um, so he comes home and he's still you know, really amped up from school and where he's doing things and what's going on. And so he's got to figure out, you know, how to create calm in the chaos. And today we had his vision therapy um, appointment. And so it's just, it's a lot for him because he goes from one, one thing to the next thing to the next thing. And he loves the activities. He loves going to his vision therapist. Um, he loves the doctor. But, you know, the decompress of his day. I know when I've had a lot going on in my day, I really just want to sit. I want to sit and just see how everything goes. Well, he, you know, he's no different. He wants to just sit and play on his tablet and figure out what else is going on and how can I blame him? So, it's always hard. 
he loves school. He's very, um, very school oriented, very much loves his, the class, the school itself, just his teacher, all of the things. But that doesn't mean that there's not those moments where it's still hard on him to do something different or to work through coming home and that type of thing. So, um, his vision therapist, um, his doctor is just, she's amazing with him to do everything. And he did really, really well with that. It's just, again, it's hard because he, he had a new bus driver today and nothing against the bus driver, but the bus driver doesn't, that bus driver doesn't go any of the same ways the other bus driver goes, nor does even when the regular or the, the one he had before, they, they still have to go where the kids are. They still have to go, um, you know, if, if there's detours or different things. And this is the part that Owen has such a hard time with because he doesn't understand that he can't go where he wants to go all of the times. So trying to teach him that it's okay to do something different, that takes time, that takes, you know, going through the motions and finding things to kind of offset that. So, um, it's a learning curve for me too, because, you know, that's my baby and I don't want to be screamed at. I don't want him to scream at other things. I don't want him to be upset that he has to scream. So, you know, it's a process like this is a process. <laughs> I'm trying to decide what I've done here. Um, and what I'm going to do to make it, I can, I have completely like changed things around to make it a rooster or something different, you know, um, like I will flip it upside down to see what we, we have. Um, and it's still like a plant. <laughs> Sorry. But, um, I'm not quite sure what's happening. I mean, it's, it, it's in my mind, it's a lot like what I was going to do, but it's not necessarily how I wanted to do it. So we're just keep going. We're just going to keep going. Um, at some point it will be better. <laughs> I don't know. Um, I don't know. Huh. Um. I feel like I should, um, see there's more fuzz. I don't know where it got this fuzz. It must have dropped something. I feel like I should have, um, a, now see I'm dotting, um, I feel like I should have a bow on this. Maybe that will make it better. A bow. Sometimes you just have to improvise when things do not go according to the plan that you didn't really think through. <laughs> that happens a lot. If you watched any of my other, um, you know that I don't always do exactly what I set in motion. So I think that's where we're going to go with this. It's just let it be what it is. Um, it's kind of, it's kind of a flower, Kind of not what we imagined. Kind of, I'm way too tired today. <laughs> um, so, it'll all work out. That's what we gotta remember. 
we stress. I'm preaching to myself here, but we stress. And so, you know, I think that's what I needed. Some more color. <laughs> if all else fails, add more texture. It's different. That's what we're going for. That's what we're going to convince ourselves that we were going for. Something incredibly different. And there you go. <laughs> Don't be afraid to try something. It may not work out the way you thought it did or should or whatever the right thing is. But that's okay because, you know, it's just paint and you can go through and change it up. And if you do another craft or write or something, you know, go for it. You can always edit. You can always change. You can always do something. So there you go. Let's see. It's, you know, it turned out to be kind of like a animal. If I put little dots in here or something, that's like the hair. <laughs> so, we have O for Owen, since he helps me with the backgrounds. He's the foundation of what we're doing here. And then L and B. <coughs> Excuse me. So that's that. We're just going to go for it, like I said. It's just, it's going to be how, how it is. This is what I do with my colors. I mix them um, because I make, I always make the paint blobs. That's my, my technical name for it. So I spread this out and I'll spread it out a little bit better than that, but um, turns into my little paint bulbs. So just different, different things. Eventually I'll have, I have a few on my website, which is sweetbabyo.com, but I'll have more. So thank you for watching and I appreciate you all being here when I talk about our day and paint. So I hope you have a great rest of your night. Toodles.